Hello everybody, welcome back to the vlog. Welcome to Isla Holbosch. I thought it was time for an update. I haven't been the best mosquito over the past few months for many reasons. I feel like I had just outgrown my time here. The way that my life direction is going right now doesn't fit with living on the island. I love Holbosch and I love everything that it's offered me. I think one of the factors is since I gave up drinking alcohol, almost two years ago now. The things that I want from life, I just can't achieve here. I feel like I've kind of outgrown a lot of things here. It's not gonna be rushed. I'm not rushing this decision. I've been thinking about it for a very long time. You know, I, I've just been through a separation at the end of last year, and I spent this year really contemplating what I wanted from life and you know what makes me happy so this year has really just thrown me into a lot of self-discovery self-growth I kind of stepped away from dating a little bit because I realized that since I was about 14 15 I've just constantly been in relationships I was like I don't even know who Lucy is anymore who was Lucy without the alcohol who was Lucy without a partner who I don't know who she is <laughs> who is she been here for seven years now is crazy I just feel like it's time to move on so Lucy will be moving on no I will not be going back to England because that's the question that everybody asks me not unless I really have to or some opportunity comes where I have to go back there but it's not in my plans I will always 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 be coming back and forth to whole wash I will be keeping my business I'll be coming to visit but the base the base has got to change but I tell you what I've never done so much learning and growing in one year I'm tired I'm really tired. I just had to change the camera angle because the phone fell over. I don't know what the original spot that I had this up in, so <laughs> if you're wondering why the background's changed, that's why. Anywho, on my little rant, I will be going to England in just over two weeks, which I'm really excited about. Going back for a wedding and just to see family and friends. Anyway, we have the England vlog coming. I guess I'm going to be vlogging more of my transition period and where I'm going next and any updates. I am going to be heading more into the creative field. So I'm doing a lot with music right now. I'm learning guitar at the moment, how to produce my own music. I've been writing a lot of music. It's something that I've always been really, really passionate about, but I kind of never had the confidence to pursue. I tell you one thing, since giving up alcohol, my self-worth and my confidence has just like skyrocketed. And it's kind of opened up so many doors for me and I just realized I'm not really doing what I wanted to do. And they say like, if you're kind of stuck in life and you're thinking, you know, what should I be doing? Where am I going? What is my purpose? One, I don't think we should put so much pressure on ourselves to find our one purpose. I don't think everyone has just one singular purpose that they have to do and that's it. Oh. Hola. There's another one. See? Oh, this one didn't say hello. Any more? Any more for any more? Okay. So they say if you want to, you know, you're feeling stuck and you want to kind of go like, what, am, what should I be doing? Always go back to what made you happy when you were a child. I think in my teens, it was more writing for me. I'd love to write. I was actually, it was kind of dark and scary <laughs> at some points. But I loved writing. Writing was my thing. I just get lost. It was a way to express myself. I all kind of got lost in my teens because, I don't know, I just followed the path of trying to be cool, you know, and partying and drinking and going out. And I wasn't being my own person. I was just following what everyone else was doing. And I wasn't myself. And to be honest, I don't think I've ever been truly myself until now. Did I ramble? I feel like I need a little electrolyte break. What flavor have we got? Sabor fresa. That is strawberry flavored. Like Ronan Keating said, life is a roller coaster. Hi. He's really creepily smiling at me. Anyway, thank you for listening to my little chitty chat. Hope you guys are okay. Hope you're feeling funky. There is a lot of astrology going on right now. There is a solar eclipse happening on the 14th. There is a lunar eclipse happening at the end of the month. So get your seatbelts on. Things are going to get shaken up. Be ready for change. Be open to change. It's okay. Okay, I'm going to love you and leave you. Thank you for listening. And I hope you have the most beautiful, wonderful, marvelous day. Bye. I'm trying not to step on um, anything that's, you know, going to hurt, really. Stingrays, the little dinosaurs that they have here. Maybe I can float, too.
Oh, testing one, two, three. Oh, the floating's not good. The floating's not good. So as I was saying, oh, what are you staring at? Be done with it. Nothing interesting. It's just a British girl with a microphone in the water. Welcome to Isla Holobosh. Oh my God, the waves. <laughs> oh, oh. Okay, let's change locations because I don't think this is working. I'm so pale.